I'm early. <laughs> Hi, it's Crazy May Stash. How y'all doing? Um, I'm Mia. This is Crazy May Stash. I, uh, I inherited a hoard or a couple of hoards. So uh, on Wednesdays, we do an unboxing of the hoard that I have no idea what we have. <laughs> um, so I'm actually early. I usually go on at one. It's only like 12, 22. And uh, I, I, want, I did want to go on at 12. I think I'm going to start going on earlier. I, I think I, I think I'm going to push my Mondays to seven instead of eight. And um, anyway, thanks for joining me. Uh, if you're watching in later, hi, thanks for coming in. Uh, so today we usually go through the stash. Uh, if you see something that you can't live without, you know, email me, crazymaystash at gmail.com. And uh, so, yes, I inherited a hoard from uh, multiple family members that I took care of until they passed. And um, so now I'm I'm selling everything. I'm turning my lemons into lemonade. So thanks for coming along with me on my journey. It's uh, it's been it's been a lot. It's been a lot. So I have a ton of stuff. <laughs> Since when don't I? I have three storage units and uh, I don't know how many uh, um, hot them cold. I'm hot and cold. Um, and I don't know how many. I think I have eight. Eight um, safe deposit boxes. So, yeah, it's it's a lot. It's a lot. So, yes, I know a lot of people don't know that I'm on right now, but that's okay. They'll come in eventually and I'm just going to keep talking. So why don't we go down scope and look at some stuff because, because we need to look at some stuff. Cool. All right. Ready? Down scope. Do, 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 do. <laughs> oh, where's my down scope? Oh no. My, uh, my down scope is not working. We'll have to hold on a minute. Let's see if this will work. I don't know where my down scope is. Okay, let's see. Why isn't this working? Tell you in a second. Nope, that's the wrong one. There it is. Yay. Awesome. All right, so I had this on yesterday. I found this a while ago in Uncle Stuff. It is absolutely stunning. It is jadeite and I believe 14 karat gold. But um, let's look at it closer. I'm going to offer this for sale on Monday. Let's look at it a little bit closer. Get closer still. It's absolutely stunning. So it's got roses um at the different stations get some thorns there so if we open this up oh it's got that yeah safety lock me a safety lock safety lock off open that up and i'm gonna flip it over and this is where it says, oh, 14 carat. And then it looks like a bird in flight. Flying across the moon? I don't know. So that's the maker's mark. Um, but I just love this, um, the carved, the carved um, rose. A lot of these you see with the jadeite is usually has like Asian writing on it, but this one does not. This one is just, um, and it has a, a safety clasp there. So I'm going to, I, I want to look it up. And we'll see. Uh, I have to stop saying, uh. <laughs> yeah, this is great. So let's look it up and see what Google says about, because I, you know, I'm always watching 
We like to Google it stuff here. All right, let's see. Yeah, so this one, like I said, has the the roses. A lot of these with the jadeite, these jadeite um, bracelets will have like the Asian words for like uh, um, happiness or good luck or prosperity. And let's see what if there's anything like this with the. All right, let's see. Let's see what comes up. So light green jade bracelet with, okay. So, let's see that one has little dragons. And Ruby Lane, yeah, that one has little dragons. Um, yeah, these are, well, that one's Ross Simmons. And that's a lot, huh? Is the Ross Simmons logo or whatever? I don't know. I still don't see anybody in the chat. Let me see. Etsy. Oh, goodness gracious me. This one's $1,195. Uh, why is it so expensive? Is it because uh, the person that made it? I don't know. It says it's just fourteen k. I don't know what that mark is. It's too small. So, um, yeah, $1,000 is a bit much. Uh, I, I do not know what um, Celadon, Celadon, Jade. Let's look that up because I don't know what that is. Let's learn something. Uh C E L A D O N Jade Oh uh, I will share my screen in one second. Hold on screen. What is it's not a type of material, rather it's a term used for pottery and other pieces of art that have been created using stoneware or porcelain and then glazed. Huh? How, then how is that a... Oh, so this one here is jade-like glazed porcelain. Oh, I see. Yeah, this is not that. This is not that. Oops. My orders. <laughs> Sorry. Here we go. So I don't see ones with the with the rose like that. Let's turn down the exposure. See if you can see a little better. I turned down the exposure. Why did it just go back up? Uh, unusual. So 
sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. I'll show you again under the uh, the microscope. Yeah, and it's 14 karat gold. And the, these are jadeite. So all the stations are a really pretty rose. All right. Let's see what else we got. I got plenty of stuff in the stash. So I don't know what we're going to price this at, but this will be ready. I'm going to have this for Monday. Yay. All right. Let me put that in a... Box so it's not schlepping around. Listen to me, schlepping. Oh, I can put it in one of these. These things are great, these little bags. Let me just write on one of these papers. 14 carat um, rose design. Um, what is that? It's jadeite bracelet. We'll have that for Monday. I think I need a container. Where's all my containers? Oh my goodness. Um, holy moly. Um, okay, I have a container now. <laughs> I just shoved everything something else All right. let's uh da, 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 da. all right so there's my up up see daisy all right Hi, lulu i haven't seen you in a while how you doing you're off this week Cool. Yeah, it is. It's 14 karat gold and with jadeite. So um, I don't know. I don't know what what I'm going to put on as a price, but I'm going to have it this Monday for sale. I wore it yesterday and it was just it was just too tight. I need something a little bit bigger. I was emotionally making it fit <laughs> because I wanted it to fit, you know, um, but my wrists are just too big for this thing. I'll show it again. And then I'll show you some more stuff. Yeah, this is really, really pretty. So it's jadeite with 14 karat gold. And then the stations are all there actually uh, roses, cut, carved out roses. See? Oh, yeah, you can see it really good there. Yeah, it's really nice. And it, I believe it's a size seven. Okay, hold on. I should fix it. No. <laughs> I'm getting used to this new camera. There we go. All right. Yeah, so I'll have this ready for Monday. Hey, Harry, what's happening? <laughs> How are you, honey? Uh, also known as greenware is a jade-like glaze that illuminates the object. The glaze is rich and smooth and uh, exquisite. Mm. Here for a quickie. You're at work. Okay, Shh. I won't say your name. Okay. Yeah, we just, it's Wednesday. We're going through stuff in the stash um, and getting ready for Monday. We couldn't do this last week because I was on Johnny's channel, but look, this is what, this is what I'm hoping to get through today. It wasted it. <laughs> oh, that hurt. All right. Um, I don't think we went through this. I don't think we did. Let's go down scope. Doo, 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 doo. I don't think we went through this before, but 
Tighten that up. Oh, 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 I see little pieces everywhere. These are great. These are great as a gift and then great for, um, a lot of people use the, wow, these are freezing cold. I think it's the green one that's broken. Yep, this one. This one pumped a, popped a link and I, it looks like a peridot. So yeah, all of these are ice colds. So I'm not quite sure how much these go for. This looks like Laramar. And then this is a combination of, oh, you can see like um, citrine and um, amethyst and a whole bunch of stuff. What color is that? Is that brown? Oh. I think it's supposed to be a red or a brown, the brown. This one's not see-through at all. This looks like Larimar. But I'm not a gemologist, so, and this looks like citrine. Let me get out my my presidium and see if it's anything's coming up at all and then we'll price them oh gosh so they are like one they're just like woven they all have good stretch yeah they all have good stretch except for this um this one that looks like peridot i'm gonna end up putting that in uh the craft slot I got a craft lot going. I am trying to get some uh, lots together for tonight for um, tonight. We're having a sale, a fundraiser for Jennifer Hayes. Jennifer Hayes lost her daughter uh, this weekend. And I don't know the circumstances. All I know is that she, her daughter passed away and a bunch of us are getting together tonight on Glamour uh, Dana. Glamma's Closet, her channel, and we're going to have a fundraiser to help with the funeral costs. So. That, yeah, it's it's crazy. I feel so bad. I, I can't even imagine losing my child. <laughs> Put the palm up there, you're going to read it? <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> then you'll learn all my secrets. Hey, be crazy. What's happening? All right. Yeah, we're just testing some things uh, to bring for sale on Monday. I'm trying to get together, like I said, some things for tonight as well. See if this test is anything. Oh, this is moving a little bit on the, on the uh, Presidium. See about this. Nothing's moving with that one. This one is definitely amethyst, going right to amethyst. So I think the purple pieces are amethyst. And then there's some citrine in here. Uh, and that might be some blue spinel. Amethyst is definitely coming out amethyst. Let's make sure that this is calculated. No, it's not calculated right. Dag, not it. My other one I never had to calculate. Uh, oh, calibrate, calculate, calibrate. This one, it seems like every time I use it, I have to recalibrate it. All right. One. All right. 
And now number two will pop up here. There it is. And then I hit this one. Repeat twice. All right. So that should calibrate it. Yeah, the other one that I had, I had for three years and I use it every day and I never had to calibrate it once. Not once. And it worked fantastically. All right, let's see. Oh, so is this Jade Amethyst? I don't know. This one is the one that looks like Larimar, but I don't even know if Larimar com comes up on a... Uh, oh, is it uh, not nephrite? What is that other stuff? Uh, not chalcedony. I always, I always say it wrong. Um, chrysoprase, chrysoprase. I don't know. The broken green beads could be. Uh, yeah, the broken ones are fine. I'm going to just put them in a crafting lot. I think these ones are citrine. Yeah, I believe they are. I don't know what this one is. Maybe they're garnet. Maybe that's why they're so dark. Very dark. Um, so I'm not quite sure how much I should sell these for either. But I want to, I'll have these for tonight. Um, I mean, for Monday. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'll probably do them choice. So I figure they're all semi precious. Um, we'll do a starting bid. How about, we'll say $10 each, and then they can choose. Y'all can choose which one you want. Cool. Done. Let's see what what else is in that bag. Um, no, we've gone through quite a few of these. I don't know if this one we've gone through yet. Uncle has, I don't know, a million of these things. Oh, God. There's... Oh, no. I don't think we've gone through this. That's pretty. All right. That's in the big pocket. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, that's a pretty stone. It looks like a dyed something or other. But it's pink all the way through, so these are definitely uh, freshwater pearls. Let me turn on the exposure. Hi, Anna. Let's see what this is reading. This is in the um, quartz area. touching different areas because it coming up is uh, in the quartz area. It's really, really nice. This is really tough. The uh, It's very strong elastic there. Isn't that pretty? It's kind of small. Let's see. What size is that? What size? All right. It is sitting at a six and a half. Let me just write that up. Get to size six and a half, and it's freshwater pearls. Freshwater pearls, and then these are quartz, I believe. Quartz uh, bracelet. Starting bid. I don't know. What do you think we should do for a starting bid? 
Oh, yeah. I don't. I don't know the circumstances. I don't know how old. It doesn't matter. Your child is your child. Your child is always your little baby until forever. You know. Um, I, I just the thought of it just tears me to pieces. I, I don't know how she's dealing. I, um, I just pray for her. I have some candles going. So if anybody needs a prayer, I got my prayer candles going. <laughs> we all need some prayers. What time is it? All right. What else do we have? Um, so I don't know. Should we Google that? I like these. These are pretty. Let's check out and see if they're gold. Like a wire. I wonder if Uncle made these. These look, these look handmade. I don't know. Could be. I mean, that's that is very simplistic type of you know making. So I don't know. Excuse me as I take a sip. Let's look let's look closer at this because I want to see. I think I don't know. It's funny. I can hold something and go, he made this. But I don't know. That's definitely gold wire. Um Yeah, that, those are real pearls. And let's see. Nothing on that side. Let's see any markings? I'll have to test the wire that the pearls are on, but these are real pearls. I'm wondering if he made them. They're really, really nice. Shiny. Oh, that one. Is that peeled a little bit? Well, maybe they're not real. I mean, nope, they're not. Those are not real. Hey, Rebecca. These are not real. But again, they do look like something Uncle might have made. They're very simplistic the way that they're made. And uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll give these away. As an uncle. Somebody has a piece of uncle. I know I, I really, there's a few pieces that he made that I just, I can't part with. So this will be a giveaway. Yeah, and I think the that uh, wire is gold. I mean, I could test it. But, you know, Rebecca, what's happening? It's a giveaway for Monday. Let's see. Um, yeah, we're gonna, we'll sell this one on Monday. This is heavy. This is very, very heavy. Let me see if I can find anything on online. I love that it's like a, like a fuchsia color, you know? So let's see what this says. We're going to Google it. We go to Google lens. Um, let's see what comes up. Some really pretty things. Oh, 
Well, some of these are coming. They're saying that they're having raw ruby or rubellet or rubellite. Pink agate. Red tourmaline. Huh. I don't know. I have to take a course and figure out. I have to learn these these stones. It's driving me crazy. What's this one? That's pink art glass. Hot pink jade. Yeah, this isn't coming up as jade. This is coming up as... Where is it? You missed me the last couple of weeks. Well, I missed you too. Where you been? So this is, yeah, I think this is some sort of quartz. I don't know if it's a dyed quartz or what, but I think it's a quartz. So um, yeah, we'll offer this on Monday. I don't know how much. But I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out before then. Thanks for coming in, guys. I really appreciate it. I know I'm a little early. I went on went on a bit early. I was getting fidgety. Uh, I'm good. I think I'm gonna change the time from uh, one to twelve. This time change thing has really messed with me a lot. Okay, this one. Is this more than one? No. This is ginormous. Holy moly. <laughs> okay. This is... We can play... What is this game? <laughs> Stick your hand in. And then... You... <laughs> uh, this is... These are freshwater pearls, and I've never seen a set this long before. Where is my, there it is. Ready? Okay, my arm, my arms aren't long enough. That's saying something. 49 inches. Am I doing this right? down 50 inches this is a hundred a <laughs> hundred inches of of pearls that that's a lot of pearl how many times can you holy moly that's a lot of pearl I don't even know where to begin to uh, to price something like this. This has knots in between every single pearl. And they are fresh water, you can tell. Watch, I'm going to go down scope so you can see it better. You hate the time change too? Yeah, it's messing with my body. It really, I think, and I know, I know I'm not the only one. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. Come on. Are you going to focus? There we go. It has to do it automatically, which is not fun. Fifty inches. I've our hundred, hundred inches. So it was uh, one hundred inches long. Uh, freshwater pearls. Necklace. I don't know if I'm going to have this ready for Monday. I don't know if 
I'll have the time. I don't know if I'll be able to find a comp for that. Have you ever seen anything that long? That is totally a flapper necklace. Wait. I mean, seriously? It's... I'm five... Well, I'm five nine now. And it's literally, it's past my knees. This is doubled. And let me see. I mean, they're to the top of my, <laughs> they're at my waist and it's doubled. That's, that's incredible. I don't think I've seen any this long. Have you? I mean, did the flapper ones, oh, look at my hips, a mess. Uh, did the flapper ones go all the way to the, like, to the floor? I don't know. That's crazy. All right. I'll try to get that priced for Monday. But then again, I might catch a release. <laughs> Pearls are hard. Pearls are difficult. I need to, I need to uh, get more versed in pearls. I just need to go to school. <laughs> that school is really expensive, though. Did you? Um, I was looking into the GIA certification, and that that's a lot. That's a lot of money. Oh, I think everything in this bag is. I'm gonna go back down. Let's go down. Let's go. Do, 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 do. All right, this just came out of here. These are look like fresh water as well like egg shaped this one does have a closure and does it say 925 uh, let's see from there let's check it on the uh the microscope do, do, do. down scope you need to get closer you get closer still yeah i don't see 925 on there Or on that side. Okay. So this is just gold tone, uh, silver tone. This is oh. magnet. Yeah, this is magnetic. This side. It doesn't seem to be. These are as well, these are knotted in between each one. Very, um, this they have these are very have a good, really good sheen to them. Let's see how long it is. It's like 20 inches, 18 to 20 inches. Where's the measuring tape? 18 inches. This is a pretty one because it's different. It's a different setting. With the lobster clasp. <laughs> I guess it's gonna be a pearl night on Monday. Last couple of weeks it's been there's been a lot of um, the stainless steel stuff. Even though I mean it looks like this. Yeah, I kept this one. I don't even think it fits. It just reminds me of Dark Shadows. Now that stainless steel looks really good. All right, let's see in this other bag. Ooh, what's this? That is very interesting. I don't, what is that? Is that a goddess? A goddess. It looks like a mother and child, and there's wings. Ah, let's get it closer. Uh, these these look like, yeah, the natural, these are natural, uh, these are freshwater pearls. Really, really pretty. Um, looks like mother and child, and I see a wing there. 
don't know if the wing belongs to the child or the mother or to both. And there's some wheat. This is resin. Um, and these are rhinestones, but these are definitely freshwater pearls on a stretch bracelet. Really pretty. Oh, this just fell out of there. That's really weird and cool. Oh, it says 925 in the back. That's definitely turquoise. Oh, it's really weird and cool looking. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it just popped out of one of these bags uh, when I dumped it over. Oh, hey. Let's see, I'm going to Google it. Let's see what comes up. Oh. What is that? Oh, I don't know what that is. I don't know if it's bone or I mean it's cold in the back because of it doesn't re really feel cold in the front. Oh, it's a jasper, I think. Look. Yeah, I think it's carved jasper. Hi, Carrie. You love pearls? Oh, yeah, this is a pretty cool piece. I have to do a little more uh, investigating, but I'll have this. I want, I want to have this available on Monday. Hey, Carrie, if you have any, um, any help with pearls, I'll take it because I'm I'm not very versed in pearls and I have a ton and I'd really like to sell them and give you guys a good price. But at the same time, I don't want to, you know, screw myself over. <laughs> yeah, the pearls are, are, are absolutely amazing. Uh, OK, now I'm having a hot flash. This is. about an inch without the bail. Uh, so that's Jasper and um, turquoise. And nine to five sterling. And then and I don't know what the starting bid's going to be on that one, but I, I'd like to get that available for Monday as well. Pretty cool. I've never seen anything like that. Um, wrap necklace, silver clasp, 1850 Tiffany and Company. Yeah, that's if they're Sigfield Collection pearl wrap necklace. Oh, uh, well, I don't know if I have any Tiffany pearls. They mark their stuff. I know to look for the M for the, uh, for the, is it Mickey Moto? Oh, no, I need a sip of tea. I need some tea. How are we all doing? <laughs> okay. Yeah, that was a pretty cool piece. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have all this stuff ready, hopefully for Monday. I don't know how to price pearls. I, I don't, but these are amazing. I love the shape of these. Like these are a common shape right now, you know, um, but this is more like egg shaped or 
I don't know how to describe it. So yeah, I don't know which, maybe that came out of this bag uh, and maybe uncle was gonna put that on here. Who knows? Uncle has so much stuff. Oh, I'm running out of, oh no, they're there. I'm like, I'm running out of bags. Let's see. So we're almost through this, this bag here. Yeah, so I think I'm going to start coming on at uh, 12 instead of 1 on Wednesdays because Eastern Standard Time. Um, the, the time change is just really, really messed with, with my body. <laughs> my body. My body is rebelling. <laughs> it's rebelling. All right. Uh, something in that pocket. Oh, ooh. Um, sweet. All right. Now this is empty. Maybe I'll sell that or give that away on Monday. It'll continue there. What? If, okay, this one. Oh, it, nine to 10 millimeter cultured Tahitian circle pearl sterling silver dangle earrings. Okay, these are brand new in the package. And it says Tahitian pearls. I don't think I have to be. Hmm. I don't know if I have Tahitian. And you can see the imperfections in there. It's really, really cool. Ah, uh, yeah, you've got a lot of stuff from Jewelry TV. These are very pearlescent. I mean, they're very, look at that sheen. Um, oh, it says something there. Okay, let's go close. Because this is like a multi-strand. Down scope. Does it say, what does it say? Oh, it's upside down. L-U-C-925-C-N. Let me write that down. L-U-C-925-C-N. I think it's, uh, I think C-N is the company. Obviously, 925. These are so... Wow, we can see the yellows and the pinks and the purples. That is amazing. These are really, really cool. I want to look at that big end one. Look at the blues. I like these. Let's see if these fit. <laughs> How do you... Oops. There we go. So there's like a little clasp there. Let's see if these are. Are these correct now? Uh -huh. Okay, there we go. These are lovely. Hold on. Oh, these are nice. Hmm. What do y'all think? Or you can wear them. Oh, stuck in my hair. That's what happens when you have curly hair. They're like fingers. They get caught and everything. So you can actually wear this around like this as well. Ooh, a little draped. Huh. Really nice. <gasps> Hi, Doug Dog. How you feeling, sweetie? Surprise. Doug Doug, you know I have lots of other things too, but this, <laughs> this is just what I'm going through now. This is what I grabbed. So, so 
So these are the three, the five strands. Really, really nice. Set in sterling. I'm. There's so many ways that you can wear this. I'm going to try to Google it. Uh, he wants to do some tests and try to remove a lot of, oh. Lucas Lambeth? Is that the L-U-C? Thank you so much. I'm writing it down. So this piece is $60 pre-owned. Yeah, I don't, I think this is new old stock. I don't think he ever wore it. Well, I got some uh, candles going. I'm sending all my prayers out to you guys. Been here since Monday afternoon. I was hoping for only a few days, but probably. Uh, sorry, but it, that really sucks. You looked them up. Thank you so much. So, Lucas Lambeth. Thank you. Yay. <laughs> All right, so I wrote that down. Um, so they're selling for 60, so maybe I'll offer them for, for, for 40 or something. Starting bid to like 40 or something like that. These are really pretty. If they didn't get stuck in my hair, I think it would have been a good release. <laughs> Well, you know, you guys would do the same. Don't tell me you wouldn't. These are beautiful, though. They're different. Thank you so much for that information. All right. Now we have these other brand new. I have, you have no idea how many pearls I have. So I have a bunch hanging here, right? I have all of these hanging here. This is not even, this is just the beginning. All right. I also have, this is full. This is almost full. And then this is totally full. These are all pearls. And, Cause I don't know how to price them. I don't know how to price them. Um, I don't even know what's in this one. It's just, it. I don't know how to do it. I don't know. There's just so many. And um, I'd really like to sell them. But just too much. Uh, this is Vendome Pearl Necklace. What is Vendome? I don't even know. What's that answer? All right. I'm cold. I'm hot. I'm cold. Uncle made this sweater back in the 70s or 60s. And I love it. <laughs> it's like Uncle's giving me a hug. But yeah, I have a ton. That's like... I mean, I don't even know what else I have. That's what I know I have. <sighs> Everyone needs some. Yeah. I think everybody needs some pearls in their collection as well. And um, I'd love to, <laughs> to share mine out. <laughs> yeah. No problem. All right. Let's grab something else from this bag. Grab this. That. Let's 
see what's oh look at that. I think these are nuts. Oh nuts. <laughs> oh those these are those easy for me to say. Um what kind of nuts are those? The, the stretch is really gone. Uh, what are the name of those? Wait, wait. Look at the size of the collar. Look at. I'm. So, it's so warm. It was 29 degrees this morning here in in uh, in Massachusetts. Yeah, it's a great sweater. Um, yeah, what are these nuts called? I'm gonna throw this in the because it's all stretched out. I'm gonna throw this in with the crafting lot. But I don't know what they're called. What are they called again? Um, I don't, I don't care. I'm just gonna throw them in the in the crafting lot. They're not really expensive, right? These nuts. Nuts. Oh, nuts. You know what else I have in the? I have a lot in the crafting lot. This this bag, this is um, cowhide or something. So, and it it's a broken purse. It's missing its. Oh, I think the straps on this side are broken. But somebody can use that material for something. It's it's perfect in perfect condition. And then I got a whole bunch of broken jewelry, and half of it has all the pieces. So, I'm sure somebody crafty can. Um, Oops, somebody crafty want it. Yeah, they kind of look like chestnuts. No, oh, there's another name. There's a different type of nut. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. All right, we're not supposed to sing that stuff till after Thanksgiving. After. So don't it. Fresh. You're fresh. All right, down scope. This says. The real collectibles. All right. Real collectibles. All right, I'm hot. <laughs> this is me all night long. My poor husband. Sweater off, sweater on, sweater off. Wax on, wax off. All right. Let me move. I'm going to shut off the presidium so it doesn't get too hot. And let's see. Let's open this up. And it says real collectible. Oh, oh my. Oh, these are Tahitian pearls. These are absolutely Tahitian pearls. Look at that luster. There's knots in between. It's a choker. And here's the clasp. Have to turn my presidium back on and test those. Um, see. Look at those earrings. Oh my God, they're gorgeous. Oh, I don't know if I can get. Oh, look at. I don't know if I can get rid of these. Um, so uncle, because of his old ears, so that's probably the original backing uncle has puts this backing on like everything because of his little old ears. Okay. I have to try one on. These are gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Look at these ones. And these are clip. Oh my goodness, those are gorgeous. So I think this goes with with this. Come on, clear up. Oh Nova Prajra. There we go. All right. 
And then he's got other things in here. Oh, these are pieces. Those look like gold beads, because this is heavy. This is a lot heavier than it should be. Ah, this one has a receipt. Cuckoo, Kukwai. Yes, that's what it is. Thank you. I knew that there was a name for those. But I'm putting that on my list. <laughs> There's certain things that no matter what I do, I cannot remember. Like, uh, I have a list. Like, <laughs> enhancer. I always forget what those things are called. Uh, pony hair handbag. Yeah, that's what that is. Uh, so that bag actually was like, um, like a two hundred dollar, three hundred dollar bag or something like that. I don't know whoever he bought it from. Um, so my cousins grew up in Hawaii. Okay, cool. Thank you so much. That would have drove me nuts. Okay. This looks like it has a receipt. And what does it say? Okay. I'll let, oh, 10 to 02. Um... I can't read this person's writing. Two grams. I don't know. These are all individually. These are heavy. These ones are very light. I don't think that that's gold at all. That doesn't say anything. And just from the feel of it, doesn't feel like gold whatsoever. Um, all right, I'm going to rub it on my teeth. Isn't that it's tiny? Yeah, this is not very well made, this little thing here that was in with this. Yeah, it's a little gritty. Let's see. Oh, these are these are fabulous. These are a whole different league. Uh I don't know. He put all this stuff together in one in one thing. I want to try these on. Vendome. Oh, that's the other set over there. It says Vendome. Shit. I'll show you those after. But this, I don't know. I don't know who made these. Uh, it just says real collection on the outside. These are pretty heavy. And it has, oh, snap. There's my loop. There it is. So, you know, he didn't always keep stuff in the right boxes. He... Okay, this is nine carat. This is uh, Ross. Ross Simmons. Oh, 
Oh, these are fabulous. Oh my God, does it fit? Does it fit? Back worst part of hospital is that someone is coming in and out with something every 10 minutes. I know. If anybody that knows, I know I've been in and out of the hospital so many times with my surgeries, the many, many surgeries and the many, many. Oh, my God, I have to go to the hospital times. Yeah. Everybody thinks that you get, oh, get some rest. You never get rest in the hospital ever. They do. They wake up every 10 minutes. I need a. I need a. A mirror. Watch, I won't be able to get it off now. I'll be wearing it the whole show. Yeah, this is fabulous. Tag Nabbit, get in there. Oh, I can't get it. This is when you need one of your kids. <laughs> or my husband. Come on. I can't get it. This is not easy. Yeah, I know. I I totally, totally get it. And you leave there, you look like a feel like a pin cushion. I can't get this closed. Uh, oh, this is up and running again. Okay, what do you mean? It's warmed up again, my presidium. Yep, these are just just crystals on here. They are not um, not diamonds. Let's see about these ones. Crystals, crystals, these, these, those are lovely. The ones I have on are screwbacks actually, and they're 14, these are uncles. I found these in his stuff, 14 karat gold with jade. It's a, it's a screw back. And uh, I'm keeping them. I like them. Right, let's try this on. I'm using the wide back. So. Oh, my God. Look how nice they look. With the wide back is holding them up nicely too. What do you think? Oh my God, I might have to keep these. I might have to keep these. All right, here's the clip on. Oh, look at that. Okay, those, I don't, I'm not a big clip on person, but they're really comfortable. They have this real, they have a cushion back there. Those are amazing. All right. Those <laughs> look so good. All right. You know, I have to try them both of these now. You know, you'll be doing the same thing. <laughs> Don't tell me you won't. You wouldn't. All right. My head's whopped. <laughs> I'm like, are they even? Hmm. Wow.
These are so elegant. All right. I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to keep these ones. These ones look lovely too, though. I'll sell these ones on Monday. Keep one, sell one, you know. <laughs> Uncle, you spoil me. <laughs> I miss them so much. These are amazing. All right. So I have the earrings. Do I dare keep this thing that I can't even close? I'm going to try one more time. <laughs> so it's got the blingy. Marge Simpson, eat your heart out. <laughs> oh, all right. I'll pop these back on. What do you think? I like it. All right. I'm keeping these ones. Keeping these ones. I'm going to sell these ones. These ones are really pretty, though. These are really, really nice. I think these are the ones that actually go with the necklace. Oh, wait. <laughs> I'm like, oh, wait. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That really does look nice, doesn't it? All right. <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel like a little girl, like playing makeup, getting all dressed up. Let me see. I don't know. These really look good too. <laughs> decisions, decisions. Well, all right, let's look at the, I'm sorry. I'm discovering these as the same time that you are. So this is, oh, that's why I couldn't get this on because the clip with the push part goes on the back, not usually the little knob part goes like up here the knob part is there to push that's why I couldn't figure it out and then it has another little latch there all right this however oh there's something else in there um this That, that doesn't feel right, if you will. There's something else in there. Let me yeah, I'll put these in here. I was today many years old when I got Tahitian pearls. <laughs> That's awesome. Thanks, Uncle. Was not expecting a prize today. Apparently, I've been a good girl or a bad girl, however you want to look at it. <laughs> All right, there's one more. Oh, what are these? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. That just slipped right on my hand and then this was in there too it's a tahitian pearls with with marcosites let's go down scope and look at it better look it's a monstrosity 
It's like we're playing makeup together, guys. I'm always on the naughty list. That's right. Uncle taught me well, but look at this one. With the margasites. One, two, three, go. Isn't that cool? Ah, oh, and then... That's crazy. I was not expecting that. This is strong. Oh, this is sterling. Down scope. Okay. It is sterling. It fits my it fits my finger perfectly. That is well, I took the same size as Uncle. Here's the other one. And see the marcasites. Let's see. This looks sterling. Is there? I don't see any markings though. I would have to test it. Yeah, I'd have to test it. That is a huge pearl. I don't know if that's real or not. I don't I don't know if this one is real. It's supposed to be gritty on your tooth, right? Yeah, this one's not gritty, so I don't think this one's real. Okay, good luck with the vampires. All right. This has to go back, go with the uh, with the set. That is an elegant, gorgeous set. I, I've never seen anything like that. Tahitian Black Pearl Collection. <laughs> Fantastic. All right. Um, so the parts in there, so there was this receipt, which I can't read it, but I'm going to put it with the other receipts. And this, I don't think that these are real, but I'm not an expert either. So, uh, but this is not just gold tone. Here is my magnet. Where's my magnet? Oh, there it is. Yeah, see, that's magnetic. But these, I think these are gold. These are loose um, Tahitian pearls and gold. Because uh, these things are too heavy for their size, if you will. Um. Oh, no, these, these aren't real Tahitian pearls. This one here is not. I don't know. All right. That is really, really pretty. I'm going to have to test that. I think that is real sterling, though. Smells like it. <laughs> oh, this is what I was wearing today. Um, I think this is 14 karat gold and that's jadeite. Um, this is again, I think it's 14 karat gold. Yep. That's 14 karat with, um, 
I don't know if it's jadeite. It's, I think it's something else. Uh, nope, this one. Yeah, this one's 14. 585 is 14, right? And then I have this one on. Some jadeite and... Yep, it's 14. And then this one is 14, I believe. And uh, it's got um, a diamond and emeralds on that. It's really pretty. It's heavy. I like it. So some of the stuff uncle gave me before he passed away and some of the stuff he gave me, you know, that I inherited afterwards. So, Ooh, what's this one? Oh, these look like old pearls. Knotted in between. They're fairly heavy. Um, the, the colors are not all exactly the same. Just says the word sterling on it. Let's double check. These look old. Hi, B. What is that symbol? Does anybody know? I don't know that symbol. Very well made. These are old. All the junk in between. And it's tiny. What is this, like 15 inches? Yeah. It's tiny. Yeah, I think these are, um, so definitely gritty. Yeah, I think these are ocean pearls. Oh, we were going to look at the Vendome. All right, let's look at that. one aside. Vendome pearl necklace. All right. Um, oh, it's an ear clip. It's another ear clip. Oh, the, these are climbers. That's interesting. Look at how this like pops out like that. So oh, it's missing the piece. Right, I have to test these. Gosh. These are not real. Um, these are crystals. They're not. Yeah, it just says Vendome. They're kind of heavy. It is missing. Um, I know I have more pieces, so it needs to be fixed. Uh, so he had the, the Vendome with these. I don't know if these are Vendome as well. These got to look really cool. See, climbers were a thing 
before, I mean, the kids now think that it's, it's something new. It's not. They're just revisiting the old, oops. Yeah, crystals. These are amazing. Yeah, climbers were, they've been out for a long time. It's so funny. I think of my mom when uh, when I was a teenager and I would say, oh, this is cool. Look at these. Look at this clothes. And my mom's like, those, those have been out for years. You didn't discover. You, your, your age people didn't discover these. I'm like, what? <laughs> I remember my mom like busting my bubble. I was thinking I was all cool. Oh, just like when we used to sing, uh, when we used to talk in uh, Pig Latin, right? Oh, look at I'm a mess. Where's my other? Where's my other curl? All right, you know when we used to talk in Pig Lot, Pig Latin, like um, how the guy, mother guy, know the game, of the giz, know the gee, the the guy. I can't even do it. I used to be able to do it really well. So me and my friends, we were talking about smoking cigarettes, and uh, we're meeting boys later. And uh, my mom came in the room and we were like making fun of her, <laughs> you know, kids do like just making fun, saying things like she doesn't know what we're saying and um, blah, blah, blah. And then uh, as she was leaving, I was with, I remember the girl I was with, it was Nancy Tato, my, my buddy, Nancy. Um, uh, we were we were best friends and she's been my friend since I was nine years old. So I remember her walking out and her saying, um, oh, I said something to her. She's like, can, can I get you guys anything else? I'm like, no, that's it, mom. And we were like, hee, hee, hee. and she's like, oh, the, oh, the oak, the K. And she like answered me in pig Latin. We were like, <laughs> we were horrified. Funny though. <laughs> now, you know, kids are all like, tch, 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 and, you know, it's hard to keep up with all that kind of stuff because we didn't have any of that, you know, we didn't have any of that stuff. So now, yeah, it's really hard. My kids are computer <laughs> bust. We were talking about smoking cigarettes and I think we were 12. I was already smoking. It was, I was a bad girl. But you grew up in the inner city, and that's kind of how it was, you know. Uh, okay. Down the scope. Here we go. Freshwater pearls. I put a, a question mark. That's right at the beginning. No, that's my son's writing. Uh, that's right at the beginning when I didn't know what was what. Uh, it was just so hard to tell what was what. So, um, so some of these, like these ones here, I'm going to hold off on. I think these are real pearls. These might be, it has a symbol. I'm not sure what that symbol is. So things like this, I don't think I'm going to have for sale for next Monday, but I need more information. Okay. Yeah, these are pearls. That's my son's writing. So these are a gray colored, but look at, so he bought these to make something else. So some of this stuff, like right at the beginning, I went through, but I kind of just flipped through stuff. Like my son was helping me. We were trying to, um, we were trying to sort things and put leg things together. But um, I didn't, I didn't know, I didn't even know uh, a quarter of what I know now. I mean, it's been a while now and I've learned so much from research and you guys, um, I don't know what I would have done without you guys. So yeah, these are definitely pearls that he was going to make something else with. So he bought these separate. These are definitely, yeah, these are real. Um, I have a whole container of beads um, I have it's more than a container. I have um, at least one trunk full 
of like beads, stones that are like on string like this that he bought bags and bags of it. And, um, you know, so he, could, he, he was making jewelry. So I guess when I get to that, I'll I think that's what all the, no, no, these are, how pretty, hold on. What is that? Is it just supposed to, is that a clasp? Do they come apart? Oh, they come apart. Okay. Oh, look at that. I like that. These are freshwater pearls. I know that. Baroque, smaller. I like that. That's pretty. Yeah, these are definitely pearls. If I'm allergic to the uh, to shellfish, should I not? Should I not be doing that? <laughs> oh, those are pretty. Those are pretty. And then, hold on. Hair, get out of the way. Oh, I, I tried to twist it around and then it just came apart. Because I want to see what it looks like with the, uh, the clasp in the front. Oh, there we go. I don't know if I, I mean, I like it. Sorry, that was loud. Huh. That's different, though. Nice. Oh, honey. Be crazy. I have trunk. At least one trunk full. At I think two. <clears throat> Excuse me. <sighs> yeah. So, um, the stash is whatever. There's just so much that the, the stash is vast. It is vast. Um, actually, I, I don't have access to it because it's like behind something over here. Uh, but there's like a whole little container. And it's with the handle and it weighs, it's got to weigh 40 pounds. And it's only this big. And it's filled with um, just stones that are on those pieces of string, you know, he was going to make stuff. So, uh, yeah. So I have a, I have one of these origami, um, shelves over here in front of my closet that I just roll in and roll out <laughs> as I need to. It just helps with, I have like three of them in the room. There's one over here that, that rolls there's this one so I can like move things around and get to different things. It's, it's really helped me with my organization. Actually, let me see if I can, can I get that. Oh yeah, I can get it. It's just. As I can see. Oh my God. Oh. This thing right here. How much does it weigh? I'm just curious. Not 40 pounds. I'd say a good, I'd say a good 25 pounds. <laughs> it's only 12 pounds. I'm getting old. 12 pounds, 13 ounces. <laughs> oh my God. I used to lug kegs. I used to throw kegs around. And I'm struggling over 12 pounds. Sucks. So, okay. 
There's imperial. I wrote on the outside beads to make beads to make jewelry, imperial turquoise glass, and all different kinds of stones. So this is it. It's got the key and everything. You know what? I'm gonna roll this over here. So it's got a key, and this goes like this, and then I just bags of turquoise and is um is turquoise and jade. Uh, this, it says in here, it says Imperial Turquoise. It says, there's a little thing that says what it is. And these are all on a, on a string. Looks like clothesline. And there's some more. And then there's all of this stuff. Uh, these are, I thought they were glass. Apparently they're crystal. And I had given a bunch uh, to, I'd given some of uh, to um, Anitra and she made a gorgeous necklace and earrings. I had gifted her some of these and they were all, they were different sizes and she's like, these aren't glass, girl. These are crystal. I'm like, really? They're crystal. A whole bunch of those. And that's just this little container. The, uh, more receipts. Um, Pacific Wholesale. This is 2005. And quantity ordered pearls, multi uh, chip, multi colored chip, uh, the memory wire, and large. Oh, no. Thank you, no charge. Somebody wrote, Thank you, no charge. I'm sure he spent a lot of money. <laughs> South Pacific Wholesale Company. This is in Vermont. It says uh, Montpelier, Vermont. It just wrote stuff. So yeah, there's all kinds of uh, receipts here. I'll leave them in here for now. But yeah. The, the amount of stuff is vast. So, haven't gotten to this stuff yet. I'm, oh, got these. I'm, uh, I'm trying really hard to get through stuff. This is a great container. That I have uh, the key to that. It's just nice. But yeah, it's it's a lot. I should probably put let me put these in there. These pearls. Do do. All right, I'm just gonna pop these. Not really right there. All right. What else is in this container? Okay. I think I'll bring these uh, for sale on Monday. This is a really cute necklace with the mother of pearl and the magnets going on there. Ouch. Uh, are you going to auction? 
Am I going to auction? We need to talk, girl. <laughs> yeah. Regarding uh, the string crystals. Yeah, those are all loose crystals, and they're all different sizes. There's, there's a lot. That's nothing. You should... Like I said, I have a few trunks full of stuff. And um, anyway, yeah, Anitra went nuts. So I'm still learning. I'm still learning. All right, let's go down scope. But, you know, so it is diff very, I I'm still trying to figure out how much to sell things for. Um, I'm still learning about things. And, um, you know, I want to have a fair price for me. And a fair price for you. So look at these Baroque pearls. Look at that one. Um, these are all knotted in between. These look like freshwater pearls. And ooh, these are really dark. Oh, look at how dark these are. These are almost black. A lot of the Tahitian pearls are, you know, have like a, a purpley, bluey sheen. These are not, I mean, I could see purples and blues and some greens. What does that say? OP925. O is in open, and P is in Peter. Who is OP? Uh, OP925. I have no idea. Yeah, I mean, you know, get a hold of me. Um, and um, I mean, if you need to i want to be educated before i sell stuff like that because i just i want to know what i'm selling i want to know um because uncle will come and haunt me and you, <laughs> if, you know, if i don't do my due diligence you know what i mean he's uh you know it's one thing i don't want to when i give away in a giveaway but i don't want to give away my inheritance either so um, something fair. I want something, you know, a fair price. So I don't know who that is. So see, now I'm getting really overwhelmed with, um, with the pearl thing right now. So now I'm like going to put them away because I can't deal with it right now. <laughs> it's too much. Uh, so these two are probably hold off. Let's see if we can Google this one though. I want to see. I'm doing for time, by the way. Oh, it's two. See, I think I like going on earlier. Because usually now, like before, I'd go on at one and I'd get off at like four. And it's like, and I needed a nap. <laughs> then the whole day's gone. All right, let me, let me try to do this. Let's Google it. Uh, nothing's coming up with the separate circle like that. Uh, all these multi strands are coming up. So there's the picture I took. Right. And then... I mean, seven ninety five, one thousand, four dollars. I mean, they they're all over the place. Forty three ninety five, seven hundred three thousand. What is that? Three thousand. What is that?
Okay. Never mind. Ross Simmons. <gasps> wow. I had pulled up a Ross Simmons a little while ago. Are you kidding? Do that that looks like the pearls from earlier, doesn't it? They were Ross Simmons. I don't think they were that long, but holy schmoly. Oh my goodness. Really good breeds. Crystals can be spendy. I used to make really too. Uh where are the where where did I just put those Ross Simmons? I was just like Ross Simmons and I put them aside. Um uh, I put them back. I think those are the ones I put aside and said I was going to investigate, right? Um, holy free holies. the heck did I just do with those? Um, well, those are OP. What did I just do with the raw cinnamon ones? All right. Stay. I yeah, threw them in here. Oh, that's the 100 inch one. Oh, this one here is Ross Simmons. Oh, no, that's Lucas. He cuts a boy. Well, I couldn't have gone far because I haven't gone anywhere. Um, I'm flabbergasted. Seven forty nine for Ross Simmons uh, Baroque pearls. And it says um, in yellow gold. So the only thing that's gold is that tiny little clasp. That's crazy. There's just so many different ones. How do you how do you know which is the sixteen dollar one and which is the sixteen hundred dollar one? Hi, Glenda. Yes, Rebecca, and some are hard to find. Okay. Well, once if you guys, you know. You guys help me price them, and uh, like seriously, I will give you all a, a good a good deal because, um, you know, I'll offer them to you guys first. I need to uh, check this one. put aside. I think those are gold. So this 
And this, I'm going to double check. Um, I do not think I'm going to have these ready for Monday, but I'm going to try. Where would I, where, I don't know where that necklace would have went. But, anywho. All right, look at, we emptied a couple of boxes. Just those over there. All right. Look at these. All right. Number one. Oh, look at Look at that. Oh, those are real. Those, that is most definitely real coral. Holy moly. Oh my goodness. I don't see a maker. Oh, that's fabulous. Let's see. Hold on. Yeah, this is these are real chunks of coral. And I know people love their coral. These are very cold. Yeah, it doesn't move at all. Little branch coral there. I mean, I don't know if this stuff is dyed or. Wow, that's pretty cool. I don't know if the clasp is magnetic. That's magnetic. So it's not in a sterling clasp, but that doesn't mean much either. That's a beautiful, beautiful piece. Let me uh let me take a picture with Google and see what comes up with this one. Got nine people here. I know going through the stash is just really different from the sales, isn't it? All right. Orange, bamboo, coral, spiny oyster. Mm. See, this is difficult too. I don't know. How do you price them? I don't know. This is amazing. I know I won't have any trouble selling this. All right. One, there's three of these little things. One, here's number two. Oh, 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 yeah, that's uh, ice cold. That is definitely. Uh, 
Oh, it's not even on. Yeah, it would be helpful if it was on. There we go. Definitely amethyst. Very cold. Same type of clasp. I don't see any markings either. No, definitely amethyst. Gorgeous. Let's see if something comes up for this. Take a close up. Hi, Kathy. Take a close up of one, one section and see what comes up for that. Oh, that stuff is crazy. That's just really cool. All right, let's look at the next one. Number three. Okay, so coral was the first one. Name of this was the second one. Oh, for the coral. What What do you think is the third one? All right, get your guesses in. I'm going to take a quick um, picture of the coral. What do you think? What material do you think that the third one is? I have no idea. Let's take guesses. Yeah, it's the same. Um, Same thing's popping up. Yeah, I'll do that later. All right, what do you think? Nobody put in their thoughts. Ready? Five, four, turquoise or agate? Oh! <laughs> Is that Larimar? Oh, isn't that delicate? What does that say? Fourteen carat. Just something else. So that means that those little beads are 14 karat. Oh man. These are very cold. Um, this is is this like a chalcedony or a Looks like Larimar. It is very pretty. No idea. All right, let's go down scope and see what this says. Because it did say 14 karat, but I don't know what else it said. There it is. Yeah, what kind of stone is that? Ooh, look at all the shine in it. It sparkles. It has a pearl and then it has gold beads. All right. Uh, shoot. There it is. Fourteen carat. G S J. 
G is in George. S is in Sam. J is in Jump. G S J fourteen K G S J. Oh, that rhymes. So, what kind of stone is this? Laramar doesn't have that sheen to it. Does it look like it has sparkles in it? Uh, like that. Laramar doesn't have that. Is this just Chalcedony then? Oh, it's very pretty. That is very pretty. Actually, it's, it's not a choker. What kind of uh, G is in George, S is in Sam, J is in Jump? I don't know. I'm going to make that up. That is gorgeous. These were, these did not disappoint, that's for sure. <laughs> All right, 14K G S J. Sweet. These are great uh, containers, too. Yeah, I'd like to have these available. I'm going to try to have these available for Monday. These are gorgeous, all three of them. All right, what else is in the bag? This is the end of what's in the bag. Oh. That's like. Oh. So little pull those through. There we go. Is that? This is very cold. I don't know if that is. actually reading on the on the presidium so this is um how pretty that is um oh god i just had a mental block I'll think of it. I'll think of it. It's definitely sterling. Yep. These are emeralds. A pretty chain. Those are emeralds. That's what it's coming up as anyway. Uh, no, this is actually um, coming up on the Presidium. If it was resin, it wouldn't even move on the Presidium. Oh, no, it's not moving. Is it because it's warm? Well, 
Maybe it is just glass. Um, it doesn't glow. But it does have like ripples in it. Like bands. I don't know if you could see them. Can you see the bands in there? I don't know. You think the bluish white might be aragonite? I don't know. Uh, it's not glowing, so it's not amber. It doesn't glow it at all. Not at all. I just I just tried to see if it was um, to see if it glowed. It didn't glow at all. I uh, these are pretty little seed beads. Oh, I love when they do the. The class, like, literally is into the, uh, where is it? There it is. It goes into the pearl itself. Hmm. Oh, they might be broken. These are pretty. These are precious. They're very long. And it's knotted. Not as long as those ones earlier. I think these are going to work. Look at it. It's on like a... It's a little silky string there these are not cold i'm gonna see if they oh yeah these light up This does not light up. Yeah, this is butterscotch amber. It looks like, you know, when you string it when you're in uh, kindergarten, kind of like the same kind of thing, but that's a lot of, that's a, a lot of good amber. Pretty. I love amber. Ooh, what is this? It's a cruisy. I don't know if these are magnetic. Yeah, that those are magnetic. But this that's a real druzy crystals on it and then there's uh crystal beads all around it they're all seem to be there um this is going up to let's see this is going up to emerald And same with this. So 
So I don't know. Let's look at them closer though. Oh, Jersey, so pretty. You know what it reminds me? It reminds me that um, those uh, slices of fruit that my grandma used to have at her house, the sugar all over it. Really pretty. I don't know what kind of stones those are. The one I said was amber could be a honey calcite. Okay. All right, I'll look that up, Kathy. I don't know much about that, but sounds good to me. I'll offer this on Monday. If I can get the prices before Monday. And a couple other things in here. Ooh. Ooh, isn't she lovely? This looks like a just got an elongated ear here. So uh, an Asian deity, I think. She's definitely mother of pearl. So there's three of those. I don't know what kind of stone that is. This stone doesn't even have a closure. This is all string. This says $12. Are these garnet? This says... $40. I think these are garnets. This one is totally, I think these are garnets. Yep. One down. Yep. Hold on, set it down. Yes. Oh my. What is this one? That one, this one goes up to garnet tourmaline, this green one. Same with this. And I know there is a green tourmaline, so I'm not, I mean, a green garnet. So I don't know if that is part of the green garnet. There's a few things in here. Oh my. <gasps> Look. It's a little owl. To look up close. I don't know what it's made of. Oh. It's made of the stuff you don't want it to be made of. <sighs> it's a 
turtle. It looks like Onyx. I can hear my husband coughing downstairs. I hope he's okay. All right. This is Jadeite. This one here is Jadeite. It's not moving for that. And I believe this is uh, I think these are peridot, these ones here. I don't even think that these have a hole in them. No, oh, they're just little nuggets. Huh. Well, that, this is really cool. I don't know if I know what to do with it all. Let's see. Yeah, see, now that's all glowy. And one of pearl glows and this glows because it's an organic material. All right. Um, it could be gold. No, I'll have to check these out. I wonder if he was going to, you know, make something with the, the green and the, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I like, I do like um, garnets. It's a beautiful. And I still don't know what that is. Huh. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Look at all those garnets. And the only one that's actually strung is, is this one. The other ones are, are on like a piece of string. So, and the, the bags that they're in, they weren't even, there's no zipper to them. They're just in a, an open bag like. These were all like this. Let's see, I'm gonna put these back in here. I wonder if he was gonna drill holes in in those in those little peridot. I think I'm gonna keep this one out because I think that's gold. Then. These three things, I don't know what kind of stone that is. These are pretty cool. All right. <laughs> that can't be all one. Oh, holy, holy moly. All right. Oh, this is as long as the last one. This is one big, all right, this is one big thing, like the last one. So this whole thing was filled with two necklaces. Holy moly. That's two necklaces. Make sure those green nuggets aren't Moldavite because Moldavite is expensive. Moldavite. I've never even heard of that. Thank you, Laurie. And knowing uncle, you know, he's, look it up. Hold on. I'm going to Google it. Uh, 
the right stone. All right. I'm going to share my screen. Huh. Images. Moldavite. Moldavite rough stones. Oh my. Did that just say nine hundred and something dollars? Others. Oh my God. Those little chunks. That's what made you think that they were Moldavite because they do. They look like this. Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, my God. They do look like that. That chunk looks like that chunk. With like the little ripples and oh my goodness. I don't even I didn't even know what that is. <laughs> was or was a thing. Holy moly. Born of the Stars, Czech Republic. It's it formed from a meteorite 15 million years ago. It has a pitted glass appearance. Oh, God. The more you know. I have no idea. I would have to. Uh, I'd have to get it checked out. This is what I mean. I, I am not a gemologist. And I don't want to get. Screwed over. Form of It's an accelerant of personal and spiritual evolution. Isn't that pretty? See, now what would I do without you guys? Because it does look like, I mean, I thought it looked like glass. I don't know. Holy moly. Everybody here is so knowledgeable, I know. Um, yes, I, all of us, I mean, I, I learned on the daily really you guys are amazing uh, amazing i don't i don't know this is nuts um
So that's what I was saying earlier that I really would like to go to a um, uh, take a course and um, or courses or get GAA certified or something of that nature. Um, you know, I am disabled. <laughs> And it's hard enough for me to try to get through this stuff and there's just so much and then I'll then I'll say okay all right I'll put this aside and then we'll get to it and we'll I'll price it later and it just it's really a lot I would really like to sell all this stuff I just don't want to get you know, messed over. I'm a mess. <laughs> uh, okay. I, I have a, um, the guy that I bring my gold to is knowledgeable, but not a certified GIA certified person. No. Um, I haven't found someone other than, oh yeah, I can do it on Downscope. Where did I just put it? Um, I mean, I don't know if that's what it is, but there are a few of them here. And hold on. They, it looks like glass to me. Ready? Let me see if I can find some tweezers so I can get my big fingers out of there. All right. That really does look like what she said. It looks like a pitted glass. Right? Wait. Hold on. I need to adjust the. There we go. So, Laurie, do you think that that's what this is? Now that you're seeing it very up close. All right. Let me let me pick up another one. All right. Holy moly. What the hell? Oh my God. So that's the second piece. Here's another piece. Yeah, see, it looks like glass there. All right. That's piece number three. That just like long that's three there's six pieces like that here's number four it's giving me a hard time it is the i just assumed it could be a peridot but then it was kind of shiny Peridot usually is not this shiny. Yeah, see, it looks like glass. Oh, gosh. We all learned something new today. So that's number four. Here's number five. Oh, 
this one's got some other, I don't know if it's just because it's dirty or. Holy moly. Laurie, how do you know so much? Share with us. Share with us how you know. Is this just like a hobby for you or? You just like to learn or how do you know about this particular stone? Inquiring minds want to know. My God, it does. It looks just like that. Now look at my screen. It looks just like this one. Didn't it just look like that? Let's look and see if there's. That's nuts. What is this? That's faceted Moldo Moldavite. So Moldova is where it landed. But it's probably not good to make into jewelry if it's like glass. Okay. Okay, so what's in this person's hand looks exactly like what I have. This is on Etsy. Oh, she did them in a nice way here. Three people bought this in the last 24 hours. Four. Four dollars. Oh, if that's a dime. Let me see. I have a dime over here. Those are very, very tiny. Oh, well. Um. Yeah, mine are... Probably like, like these pieces here. Huh. Who would have thunk? Uncle is probably very proud that we all learned something new today. He was always big on learning something new, that's for sure. All right, those have to go into a different little, get another zipper baggie. That's pretty, really pretty cool. You know, with uncle, you just never, ever know what we're going to find. Never. Hold the bite. <laughs> Thank you so much, Laurie.
Look at those. All right. I don't think that those are going to be for sale on Monday. <laughs> um, we'll just have to, um, you know, you have that with these and this, and then the most positive that's gold, I have to say. I want to test that, but that's jadeite. It's a beautiful piece of jadeite. It's carved up up here. The little leaf. Ah, <laughs> uh, I know. We're just learning so much. Learning so much. It's it's. I'm on overload right now. I'm on uh, definitely on overload. Uh, so these two ginormous freshwater pearls are like the other really long freshwater pearls. I know. Here they are. I think they're the same exact strand. Yeah, they, no. These are a bit smaller. These are more white. These are more of a cream. These are a bit bigger in size. But yeah, pretty cool. I'm going to put all those together. Let's get a bigger, we need a bigger boat. <laughs> Let's see. Put in here. Put it all together. Um, There's three of them. Not enough room. There's just not enough room. Yeah, put it that way. There we go. Much better. Three. All right. So much to do, so many things. Moldavite. Oh, who'd have thunk? That's crazy. Uh oh, what's in here? This is the last thing that came out of that uh, that bag. Oh, God, they look like. These are for smoking. It's a it's a cigar. You put a cigar in there. Never smoked. There's no uh, there's no smell because my uncle didn't smoke. So I think these are um, amber. Oh yeah, these are amber. Amber, um, you know, you put your cigar in the end there. I wonder how much something like that goes for. I don't know if I've ever seen amber um, cigar ends. You, you always think of like the, the ends looking like this because of the smoke. <laughs> you guys never heard of Moldavite either. Laurie. How do you know these things? They grade it as well. It could be hundreds or thousands. Holy moly. That is really cool. 
Laurie, is it your hobby or is it your job? How do you know about these things? Come on, if it's your job, we won't be we won't be messing with you or asking you to uh, um, decipher things. But I I really oh that one says Bakelite, Lucite. A tale of two cigar holders. I'm going to write amber up in here. Cigar holders. Amber cigarette holder. I guess it was a thing. Antique. That one's 14K. That's crazy. Look at those. Interesting. Those ones are fancy with the box and everything. Cool. I don't know. Maybe this is something I need to sell on eBay. I used to smoke a cigar every once in a blue moon. <laughs> it's your favorite stone. Well... Well, you must have freaked out when I pulled it out of the bag. <laughs> you must have been like, oh, my God. How do you hash? Just so you know, Uncle had a little bit of everything. Definitely. Uh, I'm not surprised. He knew his stuff. He really, really did. I, I don't even know how to articulate the way he just just so 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 knowledgeable amber holders i keep yawning these are pretty cool though Yeah, I used to smoke cigarettes. I quit back in 2009 when I found out I had my first cancer. Um, so I quit. But I still think about it. All right, let's change this to where is the stream yard? Um, how's everybody doing? Go up to the camera. How are we doing? I'm getting tired. Can you tell? <laughs> we went through this whole bag today. And it was mostly, mostly um, a lot of stones, um, a lot of pearls. Um, we found some moldavite. Thanks to Laurie, we know what the heck it is. <laughs> yeah, Laurie, I don't know half of the stuff that I have. I really don't. Um, this is why we do Wednesdays so we can figure it out, you know? Um, and... You know, my my thought process is always try to bring everything to sale on Monday, but that's not always possible because some things are just um, 
you know, I can't bring to this sale. I'd have to bring to, uh, you know, in a week or two or push it down the line a little bit because, uh, you know, I need to do more research. But, I mean, it doesn't matter what we come across or what we find. I'm probably still going to keep like 0 0.001% of all this stuff. Like, seriously, I don't want to, that's not the goal. The goal is to sell everything um, or just about everything and learn as I'm going and have fun with it. I have lots of jewelry that I need to go through. So I'm learning with you. That's why I love watching you. It's <laughs> such a cool person. <laughs> I don't know about that. I snort. What's cool about snorting? <laughs> Jamie B. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> yes, we're learning together. And that's really, really important. I really feel that it's important. I I love you guys. I don't know what I would do. I, this has been, it's, it's, it's really hard when you lose somebody that you love, but it's, and then harder to go through their stuff. And I really don't want to let him down. I don't want to let him down. Um, and I don't want to screw myself over of my inheritance as well. I don't own a house. I'm disabled. <laughs> this is my only job. And uh, I'm really having fun with it. And I'm having fun with you guys. Uh, I, I really enjoy it. I never really liked jewelry. I kind of... I kind of made myself not like jewelry because I couldn't afford it. <laughs> I was really poor growing up. So, but I do like it. I really like it a lot. I love that I have the knowledge. It's funny because if my husband and I are watching a movie or uh, the news, I don't know, a movie, and he'll say, well, what kind of necklace is that? <laughs> and I'll be like, that's a festoon <laughs> I don't know. It's it, who knew what that was. I didn't know that there was. It's the thrill of the hunt. There is thrill here because Moldavite, really? You know, I'm going to have to change my thumbnail to like Moldavite, really? Because <laughs> I mean, it, and and his stuff is just fast. And it's not just jewelry. He's, I've got, uh, his swords and, and, um, oh my God. I found a, 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 war, um, a civil war bullet, um, that I looked up. It had like three lines on it. They don't go for much, but my husband thought that was amazing. He, I'm holding a piece of history. Oh, <laughs> he loved it. <laughs> he loved it. Um, it was just a really cool little, uh, I forget what it was called. There was a, there's a name for it. We looked it up. I really only went for a couple of dollars, maybe $6 online if we sold it. But you thought I gave him the world. When I, it's like, cause he's a really into like, I couldn't be bothered with dates and all that stuff. I just, I was more of a numbers girl and hands on and he loves history and so when I gave him the Civil War bullet that I found, because I found it in with the jewelry. So, yeah, jewelry is just one piece of the stash. Um, and I I mean, I made the video. I only went through two containers. Um, and they had Japanese kimonos. A fan collection. An antique fan collection. Who has that kind of stuff? It's nuts. Um, and Angela from um, that other channel, I don't, something, I, it's, I forget her. Angela, she's amazing. She is so smart. She has, she uh, checked out, I told her to check out my um, other, I think Kathy told her too, to check out the fan collection and ask her about it. She sent me a, uh, she's like, oh my goodness, those fans are amazing. <laughs> So 
it's every single time I open something up, it is amazing. Um, I just wish he was here to explain everything to all of us and teach us because he, he was the best teacher. He really was. Uh, what well, one of the things he would say things like, wait a while, wait, because he was always running, always going fast, 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 talked fast, walked fast. Um, and you know, I'd ask him for something, uh, and I don't know why he would say, wait a while, wait a while, wait, wait a while. I don't know what that means, but I mean, obviously to wait, but wait a while, wait a while. Um, that was one of his things, and uh, that's what he say. You know, just certain people have their own little idiosyncrasies, and that well, that was one of his go-to things to say. Wait a while, wait a while. He was in a rush, but everybody else had to wait a while. I don't know. Um, you guys could have been anywhere, <laughs> but you were here with me and each other. Um, and I really appreciate every single one of you guys. I found another one of these things. I don't know what's in it. I have, I now have two. It's, they're full. Um, I have a bunch more stuff to go through. It's just a never ending supply of stuff. So it will go up in price. Wait a while. Oh, oh, so it'll go up in price. Yeah, I gotcha. Um, yeah, you guys, I'm really appreciative of all of you for, you know, coming around and hanging out and really being part of my journey. Seriously, this is, this has been amazing. I, I'm going to try to go, I don't know. I always say I try to go, I wanted to try to go live more going through stuff it's just there's only so much time of the day to do stuff and um so tonight i'm going to be on with um oh and i haven't done any billing this week i'm going to be doing it the next two days but i'm going to be on uh glamma's closet tonight for jennifer hayes's jennifer hayes lost her daughter this weekend and we're having a fundraiser i have to do that when I get off with you guys, I'm going to eat something and then I'm going to get together um, jewelry bags, uh, all wearable jewelry. And uh, we're going to raffle, I'm going to raffle a couple of those off and the money will go directly to her and I'll pay for, for shipping. So, um, so that's tonight at seven o'clock Eastern standard time. Let me get the link for that. And I know I have it on my community page, but let me see where Where is it? Oh, here it is. Here's the link for tonight. Copy. Jennifer, you're here. Sweetie, I send you all my love and prayers. I got candles going right now. I got St. Jude and the Lady Guadalupe and a guardian angel. So I'm so sorry for your loss. Terribly sorry. Um, nobody should have to deal with what you're dealing with. So hopefully there'll be a nice big, uh, couple of bags of jewelry that I can get together for tonight. There's the link. Um, it should be a really good night for, uh, for you and for the community. There's nothing worse. No. Um, Hold on one sec. Sorry. I'm sure everybody else feels the same way. We're mothers and, you know, just the thought of it is hard. So I'm so sorry. <laughs> Didn't mean to get upset. But I only have one boy and I, don't, I can't even fathom. So sorry. Whew. Get it together, Mia. Okay. So, 
join us tonight at seven uh, on Glamour's Closet, and uh, we're gonna. I'm gonna give a shitload of stuff away. How's that? We'll do. Um, we'll do some giveaways, and I think I think they'll let me give stuff away. <laughs> I don't see why they would, but um, yeah, I'm gonna try to throw together some uh, some bags and. And hopefully they'll get, you know, uh, they'll get bitted up and she'll make some good money. And let me too. Um, my boy is in Japan right now. So, you know, with everything going on in the world, I worry all the time. <laughs> but he's having a really good time. Um, he, he's been contacting me every couple of days. So, uh, but he's with seven friends. So. I'm, I'm really, I'm really, um, I'm really blessed with that. So anyway, you guys could have been anywhere, but you were here with me and each other going through this crazy stuff, uncle stuff. And I really appreciate you being here. So I will see you guys tonight and there's the link. I will try to price as much as this stuff as I can, uh, for Monday and, uh, have a great week guys. Love you. Love you, Jennifer. Love you guys. Thank you so much. I wish I can just reach through and just squeeze all of you. Not like this, like this. <laughs> I did this one day. I'm like, it looks like I'm strangling you guys. Uh, anyway, love you guys. Have a great rest of your day. And if you saw something that, you know, that I'm like, what the hell is this? And you want to send me some info, I will accept that gracefully and thankfully. Um, have a great day. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to others. And that's it. That's all I'm going to say. All right. Bye guys. Love you. Have a great day. Bye.